Welcome to our course, of Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2019. For modal, seismic and spectral analysis of steel structures. Advanced level. This time, we bring you a step-by-step -step course for the designing, modal, seismic and spectral analysis of steel structures, for buildings of 20 floors and above. During this step-by-step -step course, and needing of just basic to intermediate knowledge of robot structural analysis professional, we'll take you through all the necessary steps for modeling, designing and analyzing steel frame structures for mid- and high-rise buildings. And for this purpose, we'll begin by modeling this project from the ground up, so you don't miss out on any of the corresponding designing and configuration steps, that will allow us to successfully perform the subsequent set of analyses. As and as you may remember from our previous course, each element should be properly configured, before we can approach the seismic analysis of the structure. Moreover, a very important aspect of this course, and beyond observing the tools for executing each type of analysis, is performing the verification of the concrete and steel elements and their connections, under both the static and dynamic loads existing across the model. Meaning that beyond the steel bars, we'll perform the analysis and integrity check of their connections under such loads. Since this particular step, will allow us to obtain an efficient structural design, in terms of both safety and economy. So and during this course, we'll be working with this particular model. Or a steel-framed building integrated by 20 floors, and 3 underground levels. And which do its particular design, will also allow us to approach the subject, of the designing and analysis of compensated foundations. And for which the soil pressure loads should be taken into consideration. Thus and by following all the corresponding modeling process, we'll approach fundamental subjects such as the proposal of sections for both beams and columns. Modeling of concrete panels for both slabs and walls, and the subsequent analysis of both their reinforcement and deflection maps. Assignment and analysis of moving loads. But most importantly, analysis of the steel members and their connections such as those which should exist between the wide flange beams and the built-up box columns. And once we have completed this model, we'll continue by performing its modal analysis. Since, it's from the success of this first analysis, that we could continue with either the seismic or spectral analysis of the structure. Namely, that during this course, we'll approach both, the seismic and the spectral analysis of this model. Analyses that once concluded, will also allow you to observe the resultant diagrams for the internal forces and reactions produced across the structure. Moreover, and due the particular dimensions of this project, we'll take the opportunity of performing a wind simulation analysis. Finally, and although we focus on the American code, this course will be useful for the Eurocode. And furthermore, for any other design code that you may need. As many of the criteria, design and analysis workflow that we'll observe during this course, can be applied to a big array of different projects. But that's not all, remember that if you have any doubts while following this course and applying the multiple tools that we'll approach, or even while developing your own projects, that you could always resort to our support center for assistance. See you in our course, of Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2019. For modal, seismic and spectral analysis of steel structures. Advanced level.